This is a proposal for the Glenfield new build and the proposal for Glenfield is to expand the hospital out of the front of the current hospital site to include a treatment centre, new wards, new theatres and this will be where the majority of our patients, day cases and 23 hour care is delivered. The idea is it will feel like a new hospital because of the size of the scheme and as we can see it will stand very proudly where the current car park is under these proposals. The architects have thought about the traffic flow in front uh, to make it greener and to make sure we haven't got buses and cars going straight past the front door. Again this gives a nice open welcome feeling to the hospital and provides us as we go through the front door, like with the Royal Infirmary, a nice new welcome centre. This is designed to be the main reception area, nice open atrium, lots of coffee shops, places to get something to eat, open and airy where patients and families can congregate before they go off to whichever part of the hospital they need to go for their procedure or for their consultant meeting or whatever purpose they are there for. With this space, we've tried to bring the outside in. So the architects have considered how to create a kind of green space within the overall hospital so it doesn't feel as though it has big closed in areas. What we're seeing now is an outpatient clinic and waiting area and down the corridor into one of the outpatient rooms. There are going to be lots of these in the proposals for the new hospital. This is a standard consultant exam room. Because of the number of patients and the number of procedures and spaces in the hospital, it's important that it feels open and spacey and not too cramped or factory-like. Then again, going upstairs, at the moment, lots of glass, lots of open space, and this is taking us into the day surgery admissions so each floor will have a different purpose. This is the day case floor. Lots of open views towards the rest of the Glenfield site. Again, Glenfield is very green anyway, so this design is making the most of this green space. Then because of the size of the building with the long corridors, we then move into one of the treatment rooms. This is a new operating theatre. There'll be between 15 and 17 new operating theatres. This is a day case operating theatre that we're looking at now. The purpose of this new build is you're not going into the very heart of the hospital. So anything to do with outpatients and day cases remains within this new build structure. Now we're moving into one of the bays which will be post-operation. So we call it a discharge lounge and this is after a minor procedure. This is somewhere where you would sit to recover, have a cup of tea before you could be discharged. To make sure you are fit to be discharged basically means you're not requiring to have a bed. Uh, there'll be nice comfortable seats you can sit in while you're getting everything ready to be discharged. And as you can see, now we are back into the main atrium.